My name is Shoshana Stewart, and I'm a senior fellow at Jackson, and I teach a course called Development in Action. I'm also the CEO of Turquoise Mountain, and we host this course in Jordan. The trip to Jordan, which I had the chance to take with Shoshana Stewart's Development in Action class, in itself was a fantastic experience. I mean, we saw all of Jordan. We were in Amman for uh, just under a week, and then we were in the north of Jordan and to the south of Jordan and had meetings with Syrian refugees and people from government institutions and also artisans that were working with, with Shoshana and Turquoise Mountain. A lot of the trip was about understanding the work that they do. Um, and so they operate at the intersection of cultural heritage, preservation and economic development. Um, and so it's all about going into contexts where there is a long tradition and a long sort of time honored tradition of crafts and cultural heritage that are at risk of dying out um, and through going in and providing training um, to artisans um, and aspiring artisans, they're not only preserving that craft, but they're also actually providing lot jobs and livelihoods and growing that craft economy. Being in Jordan was one of the most practical experiences that I've had at Jackson, insofar as what I'd been learning and seeing from Shoshana in the classroom really came to life. And we got to interact with her staff members and see how she operates as a CEO, whereas in the classroom, we would see how she operates as a professor. And they're one in the same, but they're very different. She's Shoshana the CEO and Shoshana the senior fellow. And I think all of us on the trip really came to appreciate the skill that it takes to do what she does. I think it is a special institution who invests so seriously in the individual. And in this case, it means allowing students to spend their spring break working in a practical sense and really testing out what they're learning during their degree. So I think that the focus on the individual and the individual's development and just the, the close-knit nature of this institution uh, is very, very special. At a personal level, visiting Jordan was really exciting because I'd never actually been to the Middle East before this trip. And so um, it was an entirely new part of the world. And I think even though you have that sort of abstract appreciation for the level of history and the level of sort of cultural heritage that exists in this place, you can't really properly appreciate it um, until you're there. And so just seeing the layers upon layers of history and the sort of many different civilizations that have put down roots, flourished, and then sort of moved on in this one place, um, there's just this really, incredible sort of concentration of culture um, and, and human history. I think the other thing that was just really cool personally was getting to spend some really quality time with a couple of my Jackson classmates. With a program this small, we're all already pretty close and we get to spend a lot of time together in the same classes, doing the same kinds of activities and things. Um, but just getting that chance to travel together is I think an opportunity to build another level of relationship and understanding of knowledge of sort of what we're all here to do. It was a, sort of a glimpse into what a lot of us might want to do after Jackson, working in the NGO world, working in sort of a developing country setting internationally. So it was a really good opportunity, I think, to draw on our academic experiences and still have those be relevant while sort of projecting forward into how those might translate into a career post-Jackson. And it doesn't matter whether this is a country they'll work in again or not. Having a deeper experience in one place with one set of traditions and one particular culture uh, is incredibly valuable to figuring out both what we want to do in life and also what sorts of jobs fit us. And I think that is something that's very special about the Jackson experiences is it allows students to not only form a much closer relationship with each other, which is certainly true when you spend a couple weeks abroad together, but also with professors. And I feel like I know these students in a different way from any Jackson students that I've taught before. I think it's emblematic of the investment that Jackson makes in its students and, and to be able to take a trip to Jordan as part of a class. I think it's kind of emblematic of a broader commitment to the students that Jackson makes.